Uh, can you tell us a little bit about your role? Okay. My role as a teacher is uh, he's a passionate guy. He's a, a single-minded guy who believes in what he's doing and uh, is, in, is not concerned with the, the collateral damage that he might create. I noticed you used the word passionate to describe in there. Is there any other adjectives that you might use to describe Terence? Psychotic. <laughs> Indeed. I know you're obviously you played lots of bad guys before in the past. Is it something that you enjoy doing, do you think, playing the role of the bad guy? You know, I enjoy doing good writing, and, uh, and it's nice to be, uh, that's one of the joys of doing what I do for a living. I get to go back and forth. Good guy, bad guy, comedy, drama, and, and this really has a little bit of everything. Sure. And so you obviously you play a teacher in this. Have you got any stories maybe from when you were back in school, any teachers that you remember really fondly, or any that you remember were particularly terrifying? Really, the, the closest to being this terrifying were football coaches back in the States, American football. Um, I have many music teachers, actually, and, and some, and some theater directors that I remember very fondly as, uh, as much kinder, gentler mentors than the guy I play in the movie. And when you're preparing for a role like this, as you said, your character's quite psychotic. I mean, how do you kind of get in the frame of mind to kind of play a character like that? You just got to look at Miles' pretty boy face, you know, and it brings out that passionate anger in me. Um, no, I, honestly, just lifting it off the page, Damien wrote such a beautiful script, and, uh, and all the characters were really, you know, I felt like they were fully realized on the page, and they just had to find actors to, uh, to bring them to life. Indeed, and uh, you know, here in London, obviously the weather's not fantastic, it's not great for your, your visit here, but what kind of things do you get up to when you come to town? Uh, actually, I spent, I had my first afternoon here sort of off when I landed here, and I, I have a buddy uh, who's uh, an expat American here working in the West End Theater. Uh, he, he's doing a show, probably, he's preparing as we speak. So I, I went and visited him and his family in Northwest London, and uh, he's going to join us afterwards. Oh, lovely. And uh, you say that uh, you like to get up to lots of things whilst you're here in London. What else, what other kind of things do you think you'll be doing? Just uh, eating the famous English food. Which, uh, which I actually discovered or learned last summer when I was here with my wife and kids. We, uh, we learned that uh, the, the reputation of the British food is, is undeserved. We had, we had lovely meals here.